Indeed. Get ready to rumble, young blood. already worried about stopping you, MP. Tonight's one of those games we talked about in your goal set meeting. Mm -hmm. Going up against a top offense. How you feeling? You ready to dig in? I'm looking forward to the challenge, coach. There's a lot of ways to stop a top offense, but sometimes it's as easy as stopping their best score. Tonight, you're guarding that guy. 100%. I'm locked in. It's time to go big game hunting, MP. Mm -hmm. We got to stop the unstoppable. Mm -hmm. I want you to dominate this dude. Not keep him in check, not make him work for it. You got to shut him down. You think you can do that? It doesn't matter what I think. I just got to go out there and do it. Yes, you do. Happy hunting, MP. inside the locker room. Players' final few moments to prepare for the game and the task ahead. Welcome everyone to our 2K Sports Broadcast. Tonight's game also serving as part of the NBA Cup with Richard Jefferson and Greg. And if you claim to be a basketball purist and Greg, I know you do. One thing you gotta love watching is great ball movement which is something both of these teams take pride in. It's always fun to watch guys be unselfish with the ball and look to make each other better. MP and his team are trying to become a powerhouse in the defensive end of the ball. They're hoping to mount a concerted effort to slow teams down. So far, so good. I, I give MP props for delivering so far on that promise. But any team can have an off night. To prove you're the real deal on defense requires a much longer stretch of time to observe. Well, he's got a great stroke from the line. That's not something we can say about all the league's big guys. Looking at the starting five for the Atlanta Hawks. The pairing up front, Johnson and Capella. Then there's Reza Shea. Then there's Jalen Suggs. And it's Pufkin in at the two-guard spot. to Reza Shea. MP grabs the miss. MP with video game numbers. How about the 60, 20, and 10 triple double? An all-time game in league history. MP just doing everything. This guy is a human cheat code. Mitchell finds MP. White, wide open. He fires. And the first shot of the night for him, missing. For Atlanta, they've gone 0-3 from the field to start the game. Here's Bufkin, covered by Mitchell. Now, here's Suggs. Lays it up and banks it in. 
Payne, they've broken the seal. Three misses to start, but now they're in business. And here's White. He'll bring it up for the Chicago Bulls. A fantastic stretch this group has strung together. Eight wins and counting. You can feel the energy in the air around this team. They know they are on a roll, and they are committed to keeping it going as long as they can. Here in the first quarter with about two minutes gone by. Down low, here's Capella. Props in the layup for two. A, a big who lives inside. Capella knows he's a center. He knows he makes his living off scoring close in against that good D. Mitchell looking it over. Here's MP. Rebounded by the Hawks. That's not the type of opportunity he fails to convert very often. Pass to Suggs. Johnson with it. And here is Suggs. Nine-point game in his last outing. Now, Buzelis puts it up from 12 and begins the jumper to drop. He is a solid playmaker. White has a great sense for when he should look to give it up. Hawks have gone 2 of 5 here, making 40% so far to start out the game. And now the first timeout called here for the Hawks. Now we have a chance to pay homage to the Eastern Conference Player of the Week, MP. And you just look at the point totals that he has posted up during that time frame. Just some unreal numbers. Right, hard to argue with him as the pick when he is just putting up huge stats on offense and carrying this team with his scoring ability. Johnson finds Suggs. Back to Johnson. Good ball movement here by the Hawks. Suggs with the ball, and then Johnson with the jam. Oh, such a beautiful pass to set that one up. Yeah, the pass might have been pretty, but the finish was angry. <laughs> the three from Tatum. Knocks down the three ball. For almost anyone but Tatum, that's a bad shot. But he has the range to make all of that just so easy. Pass to Suggs. And here in the first quarter, with a little over three and a half minutes played, he gives up a bit of size at the center position, but his leaping ability, well, let's just say that makes up for it. Chicago trailing here. Outside Tatum. MP inside. Capella covering. And stolen by MP. And he'll shoot free throws here. Clearly fouled on that shot that time. The whistle blowing. And the preparation for Mitchell has made him dangerous in every facet of the game. And a chance for just a second to check out the scoring breakdown for the Hawks. Well, they're off to a good start getting it inside and scoring at close range. Solid fundamentals so far in this one. And it seems they've also put an emphasis on moving the ball. Working to rotate. Oh, my goodness, the slam! Oh. It doesn't get any easier than this. Capella's work ethic is what allows him to get those dunks. And that last look brought to you by the AT&T 5G Slam King. And so White will bring it up for Chicago. They trail by one. They beat the Hawks during their last encounter in Atlanta. And the last time these two met, they were able to get a big win because of that bench production. Second unit might be a factor in this one as well. Yeah, the reserves add another dimension to their offense, and the opposition had no answers on how to slow them down. Screen by Capella. Here's Reza Shea. And Reza Shea, the prototypical size and skill for a wingman. Yeah, he's got some jelly to his game. And here we go with the coach's challenge. Not surprised in a competitive game like this. And he's disputing the personal foul call. And, and this is the time now where the officials can... The previous play is under... Original personal foul. Getting a different angle can sometimes make it a lot easier to determine. Indeed, and the one thing with Reaper. The ruling on the floor is confirmed. Vision for just the immense speed at which these players are moving. 
and how fast the action really is and, and how hard it can be sometimes, you know, Greg, to, to make the right call. Substitution on the court. We need to make something happen. Let's go. I got you, coach. So at Chicago now, seven point differential. Count that one. MP's got six. A great sign for MP in his career. The, the ability to convert in traffic. Out remarking, and it's out there with Williams. Then it's Bruce Ellis. Then it's MP. And it's Oladipo in at the point guard position. That's the five out there for the Bulls. A three-pointer is right on target. He's got 12. It works well there. Not much resistance from the D. Yeah, that just comes down to a lack of effort. The defender has to do a better job fighting through the screen. Oladipo sets the screen for Williams. Offline with his three. And they have built their advantage on the scoreboard here by doing all the little things. Reza Shea wide open. Another three for Atlanta. That's his second triple of the quarter and third of the game. He filled him. To the paint. Here's MP. And the dunk by MP. Fantastic slam by MP, proving how dangerous he can be inside. The Hawks leading by nine. Pass to Reza Shea. Turner against Oladip. Here's Reza Shea. And a miss there on the triple. Well, you know, they're in the lead, but he's still been frustrated from an offensive standpoint. Polk loose. Stolen by Reed. Hachimura with it. Now defended by Markinen. Turner passes to Hunter over Williams. And the rejection by MP. Master Oladipo. To the inside. The kick out to Williams. Some nice ball movement here by Chicago. Here's MP. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. We know the 90s were a different era, Greg. Either win the game or win the fight. Remember that? Do you miss that physicality? <laughs> well, I will say, Kevin, it made for some great stories, but. I don't think we're missing much without all the extracurriculars. And I think we have a beautiful game now. Mitchell, he's checked in for the Bulls. Kobe White comes in for Oladipo. Well, it was the Hawks winning their last game against the Trailblazers in Portland. Yeah, their long-range artillery hit the mark more often than not. A, a great equalizer when you're on the road. And you talk to coaches around the league, and they'll tell you sometimes the ball just goes in. It's as simple as that. Pass to Hunter. White against Suggs. Capella with a screen on White. A 19-foot shot. And out of bounds as the Bulls gain possession. Here we are in November, and let's see how things are going out east in the early season. You look at the Bulls. They hold the first-place spot in the conference just right where they want to be. They've got momentum. And checking out Atlanta, sitting in second place. And, you know, right now for Atlanta, they're proving that all the talk we heard about them in the preseason was warranted. What a role this group's been on here early on. And you want to talk about hitting the ground running? They've done exactly this. And you've got to give a lot of credit to their coaching staff for getting this team locked in early. And you have got to honor White on the perimeter. Once he gets comfortable from there, it's going to be bad news for the defense. Here Suggs, pass to Hunter. Capella sets a screen for Hunter to stop the crowd and the dunk by Capella. And Capella has run pick and roll so many times, adept at knowing where to cut after the screen. Let's check in with our reporter, David Aldridge. Hey guys, MP in the last time out against Philadelphia played some huge minutes. He had 42 points, and ultimately, he posted a triple-double. And those are big numbers he put up. It's hard to match. But he'll be aiming high again tonight. Back to you guys. 
had David in stretches. He was absolutely dominant. Greg, he'd love to match that performance tonight. This team needs his contributions. When he's right, he makes winning plays time and time again. Expect them to go to him early and often. Don't want to let that hot hand go to waste. And that one's good. Reza Shane. Shots are just flowing to him right now, having a really strong quarter. Here's Bruce Ellis. And it's off from three-point range. And hard work on the glass. Once again, guys, they put a lot of effort and focus on the backboard. The putback, great positioning on the putback. And the Hawks lead by eight. And when they've gone to him, he has come through big time. you got to keep getting him touches. MP with it. He's picked up by Reza Shane. Shots good by Mitchell. Yeah, these defenders had better start closing down on shooters. Atlanta's gone 5 of 10 from downtown tonight. 50% exactly. Pass to Suggs. And here is Hachimura. Inside. Reza Shea in the corner. Just four to shoot. Two open that time. Made it look too easy. Reza Shea has got 20. This man is on fire. His team is winning, and it doesn't get better than that. MP left side. Hachimura grabs the miss. So the Bulls, the last game, a win against Philadelphia. Pass to Hunter. Now Suggs. Capella sets a screen for Suggs. Over Buzelis. And it's Suggs missing. Bulls trail by eight. Mitchell dishes to MP. Oh, went in there and tried to power it down. But true contact, he'll head to the line. That's on Clint Capella. And MP doesn't back away from physical defense. You love that about the young player. He welcomes any chance to get to the line. Chicago making some changes. Williams comes in for Markinen, and it's Tatum in for Buzelis. Pass to Bufkin. Hunter with it. Johnson with a screen on Tatum. Here's Bufkin. This one for three. And it's Chicago with the rebound. MP's got four rebounds now tonight. Right through contact, MP. Great quarter for him at the offensive end, trying to will his team back in the game. The Atlanta leading by four. Now, here's Suggs. Johnson inside, working on Williams. Suggs looking around. And once again off the mark by Atlanta. Well, the defense didn't have any impact on that shot, but somehow he's still missing. MP going right to the rim. Now, this is what we want from MP. Night after night, an energetic performance on the offensive end. Atlanta's gone 6 of 12 from outside. A very nice 50% mark. Shooting the three ball well. Johnson outside. With the teardrop. That shot missing. Excellent D there from Williams. A great Kobe White has proven he can run the show. Well, he's more than just the score. I mean, he's become a quality playmaker with better decision making. But his biggest improvement has been his efficiency. Johnson outside. Pass to Bufkin. Now, here's Hunter. Trying to find Capella. Gets it to him. Back to Hunter. Here's Bufkin. Covered by Mitchell. Bufkin, no good. Chicago has gotten half their shots from three-point range to go down in the second quarter. Three of six from downtown. And not allowing the shooter even an inch of breathing room on that one. I'm sure they'll think twice about shooting against him next time. A 
And here is Zaga. Capella finds Hunter. And that time, also a missed shot. He's cooled down a little bit after draining those two three-pointers in the first quarter. And the dunk by MP. You love to see it. MP staying engaged off ball. The Hawks trailing. Atlanta calls timeout. MP really making a difference here. Well, he's been destroying them inside, and they need a timeout to figure out an answer or a prayer if there is one. Bruzelis has checked in for the Bulls. And a switch here also for Atlanta. Nas Reed, he's checked in for DeAndre Hunter. Nice ball movement here by Atlanta. Pass to Reed. Over Tatum. The Hawks again can't hit. And offensively, they've gotten stuck on the perimeter, falling in love with the jump. MP with it. Over in the corner, White traps in the tray. And it's a five-point Bulls lead. And, and he has really come to life here after a slow start in that first quarter. Johnson outside. Pass to Suggs. Reed with a screen on White. Suggs passes to Reed. Up again. It's good on the putback. And, folks, he did not luck into that one. He knew just where he wanted to be to grab that backboard. To the middle. Who's jealous? No one around him. Buried from outside. But I don't know. I think we may see a review here. Time just yet. Officials signaling they are going to review the tape. Yeah, that, that's a tough call there with, with the naked eye. Fortunately, the league's replay center able to slow it down. After the review, the ruling on the floor is overturned. And they're going to switch the call. There is no doubt from looking at the replay that he got it off in time. Well, it's good they decided to take another look at it. I know some folks don't like how replay slows the game down and interrupts the flow, but when you have it there, you got to use it. And so it's MP making things happen for Chicago. His production has been flowing as he's tallied 20 points and looks to be planning for more. And we'll be right back after this. Hello, folks. The first half is in the books, and we've got a lead on the scoreboard for the Chicago Bulls. They're clicking from outside. Hard cups to the ball and a few bone-jarring screens. Man, they have a high quality of looks. They've been cashing in on those. We'll see if the sharpshooting continues. Taking a peek now at the upcoming schedule. Looking at the Bulls, I don't look at win-loss records at this point. I want to see improvement from game to game. I wish fans saw it that way. Most of the time, it's about instant gratification. And that's all for us. Now it's time to send it back to Kevin Harlan for the beginning of the third quarter. And if you're just joining us, we've played through the first half in a game that's been fairly even so far. Chicago leading by six. On the court for Atlanta. The front court is Rizuche and Johnson. Then it's Clint Capella. Then there's Suggs. And it's Pupkin in at the two. This has been a special performance by MP, and he doesn't look like he's anywhere close to being done. So it's the Hawks now. They host the Clippers after this game. That game will be a quick pit stop before hitting the road again. And the foul called on Donovan Mitchell. That's his first foul. First personal foul. First team foul. MP against Capella. Pass to Johnson. From deep. It's hauled in by MP. MP's got rebound number 10 tonight with that last one. And here's Mitchell from the arc. 
It's hauled in by Clint Capella. Capella's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. Mitchell against Suggs. Over Mitchell. And he buries that one, drilling the rim on the way down. Suggs has got six. Well, that, that's one way he can finish, but far from the only way he gets it done. He's got all kinds of tricks up his sleeve. White finds MP. Out to White for three. Rebound Atlanta. And the defense dodged one right there. Not the guy you want to leave open. Pass to Rizuche. No one near Suggs as he lets it go. Sinks the triple. Suggs has got five points now this quarter. You give a shooter of his caliber that much time to seam it up? Oh, yeah, you're done. White dishes to Tatum. Let's it go from deep. And White, the bucket on the assist by Tatum. Tatum's got three assists tonight. And the D has gotten a little bit laxed here defending the triple. Pass to Capella. Over MP. And the read kitchen by MP. Outside White. And here is MP. Capella covering. The three from Tatum. A shot. No good. And close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. Pass to Bufkin. Here's Reza Shea. Just five to shoot. And the rejection by Tatum. The all-star Tatum engaged on defense. That's a scary sight for opponents. A touch over two and a half minutes of basketball played here in the third quarter. Just enough coverage to bother that three-point attempt. Pass to MV. Knocked loose. It's three on three on the fast break. Here's Bufkin. Johnson with it. Covered by Mitchell. Takes the 13-footer. Chicago grabs the miss. MP's got rebound number 12 here already in the game. Outside Tatum. Fires from deep. Good, and the assist goes to MP. MP's got four assists in the game. The Hawks trail by nine. Second half here, we're just over three and a half minutes into it. Capella with a screen on white. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. And with the offense getting right to the rim, at least they saved the layup. The Hawks have made their free throws at a pretty good clip. They've hit eight of ten. Both free throws, good from Suggs. And so White will bring it up for the Chicago Bulls. On the wing, Mitchell. The three from Tatum. Rebounded by Capella. Capella's got rebound number 11 for him here tonight. Pass to Rizuche. And the basket is good, and he's got a chance here for one more at the line. And guys, the knee has to show a little more fight on the interior than they did on that trip. And let's get your take, guys, on the scoring breakdown for the Bulls. The name of the game in the modern NBA is making threes. Space in the court, and that's exactly what they are doing tonight. And their passing has been great as well. Ball movement is key in getting good looks, and they've had that down tonight. Reza Shea with it. He's got 23. Johnson sends the screen for Suggs. Can't get it to go. He's made four and just missed his fourth. Now, Buzelis. He's got 10 to the paint. There's MP. MP's strong inside. 
And MP loves getting this close to the rim. Feels comfortable from this area. The Hawks trail by nine. Now, here's up. 11 points in the game. Fades and shoots. Shot by Johnson, no good. They're losing because he is struggling so bad, and he has not looked comfortable all game. Floats it up for MP. Oh, MP with the catch and flush. You see that youthful exuberance from MP on that finish. Atlanta's gone one of three from downtown since halftime. Pass to Bufkin. Capella sets a screen for Rizache. And it's Capella missing. Give the defender credit. Willing to challenge the shot. Lots of other guys just let them score there. Now, MP. Capella covering. Out to White. Good ball movement here by the Bulls. Tatum down the hill. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. That's on Clint Capella. The length and athleticism of Tatum is something else. Like you can't blame the D for fouling him there. That's just something that's going to happen. Markinen, he's checked in for Kobe White. Hunter's checked in for the Hawks. The Hawks trail by 12. Pass to Capella. And the rejection by MP. And it's out of bounds to the Hawks as Atlanta retains possession. And here is Hunter. He's got six. Just five on the clock to end the run. He clangs that one off the back iron, and down it falls. Hunter's got eight points. And it's his decision-making. Hunter looking like a surgeon, the way he operated that pick and roll. Here's MP, and the dunk by MP. Oh, oh inflicting some punishment with the two-hand flush. Ah, they're going for the throat. The Hawks trail by 12. Here's Suggs. He's got 11. For the three. A second chance effort. And Capella with the layup. 16 points for him. And he's doing everything he can offensively to lift them out of this hole. But I'm not sure his hot shooting can do it alone. Offensive rebound. And the dunk by MP. Playing hard. MP crashing the old boards. Getting second chance opportunities. Atlanta's gotten the three-point shot off 16 times tonight. Seven times they've hit it. Nine times they've missed. Suggs passes to Hunter. Back to Suggs. Fires from 14. And again, it's Atlanta. Wow, he is lighting it up here in the second half. The Bulls leading by 10. Outside Tatum to the inside. Here's MP. Great focus, MP. And they're forcing the ball inside, and it's working like a charm. Atlanta has gone one of four and three point shots here in the third. Pass to Suggs. Two minutes remaining in the third. Two minutes. Here's Reza Shea. Five to shoot. Capella with a screen on Markinen. Here's Reese's shade. Off the mark and a chance to trim it to single digits. Well, after the show he put on in the first half, he thought it would continue, but he's cooled off a little bit here now. Now, Bruzelis kicks it out to Mitchell. No good on the three. The Hawks trail by 12. Pass to Hunter. Puts it up from 12. Great D that time from Tatum. Inside. Here's MP. Good, and it's Tatum picking up the assist. Tatum's got six assists in the game. 
The desire to win, it, it fuels MP. It, he doesn't let anything get in his way. Atlanta calls timeout. MP really making a difference here. And he's in a complete groove right now. I don't think they can stop him altogether, but, but they at least need to make him work a little harder than he has been. The Bulls are making a switch here. Oli Bose checked in, and then for Atlanta. Reed, he's checked in for Clint Capella. Hachimura comes in for Riza Shea. And Turner's subbed in for Suns. Here's Hachimura. Shot goes down. Very quick possession right there. Over the last few years, Hachimura has gotten more comfortable in these catch-and-shoot situations. Pass to Buzelis. He's looking for MP and finds him. Poked away. It's stolen by Hachimura. Reed with it from outside the arc. Victor Oladipo grabs the miss. And sometimes on defense, you can just get lucky. And they double up MP. Lands soft on the front of the rim and drops. MP's got 16 points here in the second half. The Hawks trail by 14. About three seconds between shot and game clock. Outside Turner. down low, guarded by Tatum. An athletic forward with, with a versatile skill set. Hunter has also proven he can come up big in big moments. For the Bulls, MPs checked in for Williams. And Donovan Mitchell subbed in for Bruce Ellis. Atlanta making a switch here. Here's MP. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. Oh, crafty move there from MP to get to the foul line. The young man fearless inside. Williams, he's checked in for the Bulls. And both free throws good for MP. The Hawks trail by eight. They've got MP. Mitchell is out there with Kobe White. Then it's Williams. And it's Markinen in at the small forward position. So that's the five in the game for Chicago. Nailed from three-point land. Goodness, this man is ripping three after three. An incredible display of shooting. Williams finds MP. Reed with the rebound. Hawks have gotten absolutely red hot shooting the ball here in the fourth. A perfect six for six. Suggs passes to Reed over MP. Chicago grabs the miss. They've led by as many as 14 points. And the dunk by MP. He's so quick off the floor. MP punches that one home with ease. The Hawks trail by seven. Down low. Here's Reed. And foul on the shot. So he'll get a chance at the line. It's going to be on MP. No question, he got bumped on that shot. This is as good as it gets from the charity strike here in the second. Tatum, he's checked in for Chicago. Bruce Ellis comes in for Mitchell. One of the most explosive scores in the NBA, the great Donovan Mitchell. Well, I think what makes his offensive game so elite is that he is a very strong and physical guard. He's improved his pick and roll game, and he's improved his distance from three. So the space that he has to work from is so impressive. Think of uh, D. Wade with a better jumper. Tatum deciding where to go with it. MP left side. Fouled in the act of shooting. Gets the bucket anyway, so a three-point play chance for him. They're finding lanes to the hoop now with consistency. Five buckets in a row from the paint. Free throw good, MP. And you talk about building a legacy. That's MP's mindset, not just for himself, but for this team. Reed with a screen for Riza Shea. Launches a three. Hands it from downtown. The defenders need to recognize the importance of staying on him as we get into crunch time. Outside Tatum. Pass to MP. Rebound by the Hawks. Hachimura with it. Up top Reed. Here's Suggs. White covering. 
Reed with a screen on White. Duggs, a three-pointer, no good. And so White will bring it up for the Chicago Bulls. Leading by five, Tatum finds MP. Reed with the rebound. Reed's got four rebounds in this game. Suggs passes to Reed. Back to Suggs. Pass to Reed. It's up a three. And it's White with the rebound. And even without that three ball dropping for him, the defense should have done more on that last play. And they double up MP. Here's the three. Here's Bruce Ellis. Trains the three-pointer. And that's on the defense there. Bruce. Gotta know the scouting report and understand that he loves his shot. The Hawks trail by eight. Timeout, Hawks. Well, it's been an express lane to the rim. Coach can't be happy about that. Yeah, we can see over here. The coach, he has some choice words for his team. Words we cannot repeat. Donovan Mitchell's checked in for Markinen. Getting the latest now from our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David, it's all yours. Take it away. Hey, guys. Well, the Hawks coach had some words for his team during the last time out. He told his team they're being too reckless with the ball. He said, you're turning it over left and right. You've got to be smarter and more in control out there. Guys, back to you. Okay, David, much appreciated. And defensively, guys, they've been unable to shut down the middle. Hawks have gotten more than 58% of their attempts to go down for them in the fourth quarter. They're 7 of 12. Suggs against White. Johnson gets to Capella. Shot clock at 6. Here's Bufkin. No good from outside. Got the defender off his feet with the pump fake, but couldn't knock it down. Tatum inside and MP throws it down. Oh, come on. Just add vision to a perfect skill set. But when he's dropping dimes like that, like Jason Tatum is a problem. Here's Bufkin. Trying to find Johnson. He's got it now. Pass to Capella. The Hawks working the ball around. Here's Bufkin. The Hawks again can't hit. He is single-handedly dropping the temperature in here with that cold streak. Yeah, <laughs> right now, he's just in his own head. Not much you can do to try and push through it. Tatum no good. That is fantastic defense on one of the best three-point shooters in the league. Didn't give him an inch of room. To end the cold streak. <laughs> And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Fourth personal foul. No good on the free throw. And Greg, everyone loves talking trades. Future first round picks have been moved quite a bit of late, and that's been kind of interesting. And Kevin, a lot of teams that don't control any of their future first round picks with so much pressure to win now, GMs are willing to use draft assets. The dunk and the foul, a powerhouse move, and he's got a chance for one more at the line. That's on Clint Capella. What heart by him, P. Going through contact there and converting. The Hawks trail by 14. High pose, Johnson. Tatum on him, and it's blocked, and they get it back. Capella against MP. Clock at four. Second chance shot. You should know a young guy like MP is looking to send that shot all the way into the crowd. Here's White. Pass to MP. And they double up MP. Tatum on the wing. Floats it up for MP. An emphatic LU jam. Outstanding finish there. I like whenever MP goes after those opportunities and their teammates puts them in the right spot. 
The Hawks trail by 16. There's 154 and left here in the fourth quarter. Here's Buffkin. And the rejection by MP. Rocket six to the inside. And then Johnson with the dunk. This guy is a high flyer. I mean, especially for a power forward, and he needs to be as an undersized player. Reza Shea with it. Johnson right side. Pass to Capella. Johnson with a screen on Mitchell. Back to Capella. Reza Shea in the corner. A three-pointer off the mark. Good job by the D to stay with him and make that a tough three. Now White to the middle. Buzelis with the ball. No good from outside. Not quite enough defense. That time around, just lucky he was off. And clearly, we will not be witnessing a spirited comeback tonight, albeit as exciting as that would be. This was an excellent all-around performance for the Bulls. And guys, the fast break was run, I thought, beautifully all night by these guys. I think that was a big part of their success. Yeah, they definitely ran the break well. A big advantage in that category, and they continually put pressure on the defense. And they took charge when it counted and will be notching their ninth win overall. And continued dominance against this team, winning both of their matchups this season. And you know, when you look at the huge impact he had, just a monster game for MP. Honestly, I just love how relentless he is on the glass, making a big effort to pull the ball in and give his teammates extra chances. Grabs the rebound again. Collecting yet another board. He's been everywhere. Just sensational. And so Chicago takes this one and by a big margin. And with that, they remain undefeated in group play. And with just one group matchup left, it looks like we'll be seeing them in the next round of the NBA Cup. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. Richard Jefferson, Greg Anthony, and David Aldridge. This is Kevin Harlan thanking you for watching tonight's game on 2K Sports. See you later.